So right over here, I'm going to borrow Rob. So understand, like, with the positioning, that any time that if, if um, let's say, if he's not grabbing my elbows, let's just say that he's just resting it on my head or my shoulders, guess what I'm going to do? I can head butt. I can hit with that elbow. So this is the reason that's important, that any time that somebody has a lock on your position, you're grabbing that crease of that arm. His elbows are not for, uh, flailing out, because if they're out, guess what I'm doing? I'm automatically kneeing at that point. So I want to make sure that as I'm doing this motion, is that as he, um, you go ahead and do the movement, he basically pops my elbow, watch what happens. As soon as he locks it, what do I do with this other hand? A lot of you guys are just keeping it by the shoulders. I'm automatically grabbing that crease so he doesn't hit me with that elbow. And then he goes, and he goes again, and then I'm locking, because I'm trying to get my position first. So again, as I pop it, as soon as I shoot it straight in, he should be looking to kind of control that position. Right over here, because then we might be fighting in that 50-50 position, and then I'll go ahead and lock it in. Then he pops my elbow, pop. As soon as you get that, look what I'm doing. I'm ready trying to fight for positioning. And then he goes ahead and locks it in, and we lock it, okay? So as you guys are doing it, it's not gonna work if you're gonna just hug the person. Like, so, so you go ahead and, you, you guys are like, no, seriously, it's not gonna work. Remember, you gotta basically clamp onto that person's head. He's gonna go ahead and do the motion. It's gonna work because mechanically, it's correct. And then he goes again, boom, and then he locks it. As soon as he locks it that hard, look what's happening. I just gotta lean my body back and you can just see what's happened naturally with his body. No matter how hard he goes, I can basically, my whole body's gonna be stronger than his arms. And then I lock it I'm back over here into my stance. Okay, does that make sense to you guys? Okay, so lock it just a little bit so that they get the right pressure and then you guys will be able to do the move uh, successfully. Two cops on two, one, two.